Pauline Nolan, 58, candidly admitted her lack of expertise was giving her a serious case of nerves, but, in an unexpected twist, it turned out to be Top Gear star Paddy McGuinness who was mocked over his bakes with his co-star gasping, What the hell is that? I'm ashamed to say that I'm terrible in the kitchen, the Loose Women star began gingerly on the Channel 4 show, adding that standing before the judges was making her legs turn to jelly. However, Patty would later be told by one of the hosts that his creations looked like they belonged in the bin. As he asked early on in the show if he could store his creation in the fridge, presenter Noel Fielding exclaimed, Did you say in the fridge or in the bin? Leading Patty to hit back, mate, Terry's absolutely no need for that. The insults continued to fly as viewers were glued to their screens, but the most amusing moment was yet to come. When the celebrity bakers were challenged to recreate their hometowns in biscuit form, a proud Patty presented a tribute to his beloved Bolton. However, his interpretation of Barrow Bridge Chimney left his co-stars astonished as he unveiled the phallic-looking structure. What I was looking to do is give you Bake Off's biggest erection and I feel as though I have achieved that, he joked as he revealed his gingerbread creation, complete with a mouth-watering caramelized strawberry on top. Earlier on, Patty groaned as his biscuit collapsed in the oven and, in another innuendo, quipped, a shaft has collapsed, story of my life. We do not get stopped by a ginger biscuit, he continued adamantly as he vowed that he would make another batch. Dot however, his creations left a bewildered Colleen exclaiming, What the hell is that? Patty also admitted one of his other creations looked like two baguettes nailed to a pole, admitting he hoped it tasted better than it looked. After all, Ellie Taylor had previously admonished Paul Hollywood for judging the aesthetic quality of her baking, telling him, looks aren't everything. At one point Top Gear legend Patty finally received glowing praise from the judges, including Paul, when his cheese and onion slices earned him the highest ranking out of all four contestants. The TV star, who had competed alongside Colleen, the Inbetweeners star Joe Thomas and Strictly Come Dancing star Ellie Taylor, declared the result unbelievable. On a more serious note, the show aimed to raise awareness for Stand Up to Cancer, as it was revealed one in two people will suffer directly with the potentially deadly disease at some time in our lives. One special guest heartbreakingly recalled how her young son Charlie had died after battling tumors on his brain, spine and pituitary gland, meaning he would never grow any taller.